<clears throat> yeah, hey, I need a cap. On its way, sir. Thanks for calling. Appreciate it. El Burro Heights. I'll get you there fast, buddy. This is the spot, right? Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. Praise me. You weren't married to her. Yes, you you need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're going to make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean, I need something done. You need to know something, so why not help each other? I got to make some dough. You're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. Well, I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone that instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah, yeah, well. <laughs> Since you put it like that. Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little college boy sack of shit, phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. I heard him say that he saved America. What, by, by outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. The hell are you talking about? You are about to get... That white-collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. Uh, I'll find something. Just like the old days. I'd like to order a cab, please. Not a problem. A driver's on the way. Great.
can I take you? Alta, right away, sir. Okay, buddy, there you go. Hey, what's going on, brother? Yo, dude. <sighs> ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? All right. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Goodbye. Get a cab here as soon as possible. I'm sending one out right now. Sounds good, thanks. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act... Hey. Hey. PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind <coughs> seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke bricks about up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I, I, I T-Temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Ah, uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. You know, a consultancy, consultancy, consultancy. I'm kind of big on the conference tour already. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. Really? 
The brief was for a relaxed, creative individual, the kind of can sort of beanbag over a wheelchair, but if you're so... Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. Your son codes? Start him early, bro. You write your best stuff in your tweens. After that, it's just a hack job. Okay, we got some space. I'll try to boot up this antivirus. You want a massage? Cause my hands are free. <laughs> Scanning. Might I tempt you with some organic chow or a fair trade java? These hacker kids always come up with a new way to screw the network in the ass. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. You should have been there. Oh, oh my. Going down to your level? Hey, hey, hey! Hey, Michael, hold on, hold on. Domed! I domed ya! Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry, the phone is rigged. Now, what's your problem? You don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes, none of which interest me. Hey, I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Ah, uh, whatever you say. Enjoy yesterday. Anyway, just call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. 
Yo, Terrence, what it do, bro? All right, we almost there. What it do, bro? Can you hear everything good, bro? I fuck with the audio a lot. Move for some GTA. You talking about me or you? Are you good, bro? All right, what about the game and the music? I got it where I separated out the audio again. Oh, you oh you in the mood for some GTA, man? For sure, bro. For sure. See, you about to get in, man. He just doing this mission right here. It's where he blow up dude. I think he blow up dude or something. Perfect. All right, for sure. Loud and clear, for sure. I'm just chilling, man, vibing, man, doing a little GTA. A little sleepy. Oh, here you go, here you go. Then we got a column. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full on weapons grade red alert world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain and we have milked every penny we could in the process. But we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years. That's not just impressive. It's revolutionary. You can hear the game. You can hear the game good. Today, right here, we're about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. Yeah, let me know. Invader mobile device. Yes, we have invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay right, 24-7. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with some kids at the public pool. We went to the guys at Fruit Computers. All right, here we go. Here we go. We wanted to make our hardware as compatible as possible. But you know what? They're not interested. Oh, hold on a second. Here we go. Someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Damn. No, 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 no. Whoa. <laughs> Mission pass, let's go. All right, let's see what else we got. He can change clothes in his bedroom. It's upstairs, I think. <laughs> Les, that was heavy. You watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can Hey, Mark, hey, hey, for real. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. This game dope, bro, for real. Uh, let's see here.
This look all right. Let's see. Let's do that. All right, let me see here. Let's go to the next mission, bro. Bro, this be looking so good on PC, bro. I mean, bro. Uh, it's like, damn, bro. I should have been like, went PC a long time ago, bro. Uh, so we got Lester right there. Uh, we got a couple missions for for our boy Franklin. Let's do this one though. We'll keep doing. We'll keep doing this. Do I want to drive? Nah, we'll take a taxi. Way, sir. Thanks for calling. Appreciate it. I've got a good quality daytime program, and that's what they're here for. They do, bro. For real. They really do, man. You see, bro, like I'm always talking about it, bro. It's just like my mind blown. You feel me? Where can I take you? La Mesa. This is the spot, right? I've been on console so long, man. Buy me an outfit then. <clears throat> What's it? Uh, let me see. We got a car somewhere. Be nice if I can get a car sent to me. Let's see. We're the closest clothing store. Vehicle impound. All right, that's where we going. Call a cab, go there. It's something decent. I like to order a cab, please. I'm sending one out right now. Great. Bro, it's a big difference, bro. I, I'm, bro. Bro, I can't even explain it enough, bro. Like for real, I turn, bro. I got, I got shit here soon, bro. I'm gonna have a couple of monitors, bro. Cause I'm gonna give me another one of these. Yeah, I just hope, I just hope my computer can handle it. That's what I'm worried about. I don't know if my computer can handle two screens of this. I don't know. I'm not sure. That's going to be the challenge. But, bro, when I do that, bro, I'm going to have three monitors, bro. And, uh, no, I, I cut you a deal on one, bro, for real. I think I spent, what, about... 150 on them, bro. I, I shit, bro. I let one go for like 50 bucks for you, bro. Hey, honeycomb. What's up, honeycomb? What's good with you? I'm just playing story mode. I ain't in the city. I'm just playing story mode right now. I ain't never finished the story. So where do you want to go? Textile city. All right, let's hit the road. All right, let's skip here. Yeah, I cut you a deal on one, bro. I don't know if they got suits in here or not, bro. I don't think they do. Oh, here goes some suits. Let me know if you need a hand, okay? Can I go here and buy? Oh, hold on, there it was. There it 
There we go. Oh, that's shoes. I like them. Enjoy. I like them. Oh, I might not be able to. That's shirts. Nah, I might have to go to a high end. I might have to go to a high end. Somebody say something? Yeah, let me go to a high end store. Dang. Where would a high-end store be? Suburban. I want to say it's that one. Which one? Which one is this one? This a this bingo. All right. So this bargain. Okay. Which one would be the high-end? I wonder. Is this a? I think it's. Let me try right here. Up oh, there go a taxi right there. Oh. Ah. Yeah, I need a cab as soon as you can. Not a problem. A driver's on the way. Thank you. This that this that new Roddy Rich man. That shit bumping uh turns. That shit bumping. I like this new Roddy Rich. Let me play that bad one time. So you know who that is. Oh, you been bumping it. Uh, you been bumping the new album. No, 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 no. Hey, my man, where you going? Rockford Hills. You're blocked. All right, brother, here we are. Oh, yeah, this high. Oh, yeah, I'm here if you need me. Oh, y'all know who Roddy Rich is? I'm surprised, bro. Ooh, these things is high. Good day. Mm, let's do this one. See who this yeah, is. Who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do is your business, bro. <coughs> Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintroduced. Dang, boy, how we go from 15 people to two? Good day. Now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. I thought. Hey, he clean, ain't he? <laughs> I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. I don't know where we going. Way, sir. Thanks for calling. Appreciate it. 
See if I had the bread, I'd get sunglasses out of it. La Mesa, I'll get you there fast, buddy. Okay, buddy, there you go. All right, here we go. What the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. San Andreas, yeah. Bro, I ain't never, I have never beat a Grand Theft Auto. Ever. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks. I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy. You know they they got the older ones on the new systems, bro. I might I might mess around and get them, man. I met him. He was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Hey, you you haven't either, yeah, bro. I've never hey, beat one. Hit a bank and a sticks, or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. So I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old Running from the cops. Yeah, exactly, bro. Shooting no shit. Running from, from the cops. Those <laughs> crazy. They mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was a, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but nah, he went quiet. I can't wait to see this new one that come out. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. We're going to Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back at Hey, bro, it is, bro. FIB For buddies. real. That's going to be the hottest game, bro. Like, when GTA 6 drop, that's going to be a hot game, bro. Witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Tell me good news. Yeah, baby. House number seven. Bullshit. And that's Tiger's just in Rockford girl. Hills. I always wanted a place on Eclipse Boulevard. More for storage than... Yes, I'm real. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Sir, thank you. Glasses are live. Shoot away. All right, I got an idea of their CCTV setup. Uh, can you shoot an air vent in the alarm keypad? The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. All right, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. Uh, shots come through. Camera, check. Alarm, check. Vents, check. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... Ten grand? Our rings start at eight. Our pendants start at twelve. 
All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh... Know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. I'm on the roof. All right, use the glasses to get me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. <clears throat> He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD, shootout, maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway. They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Oh, hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. Let's hurry this up, Michael. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Well, nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. Alarm systems linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register, so I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. 
Uh, might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. Here are the photos. My uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options. I'm showing you all the angles, that's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Getting ready for a jewelry store robbery. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knock <coughs> gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSP the tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras, but the length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run into the front door or try to play it smart? Hey, how should we do it, uh, Terrence? What you think? Should we go in loud or smart, bro? What you think, bro? What should we do? Loud or smart? You gotta make a call on this. <laughs> ah, still a hothead? You know, some things never change. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Guns. Yeah, it might be hot and heavy in there. This guy will keep it from going bad. Gus Moda. We he definitely want a good shooting. Say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Let's take a chance on him. If you're happy, I'll start making the arrangements. Okay, uh, I'll look into how you can find a tack team and get their weapons and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes, huh? good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what, my rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man. I'll call you. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um... I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high, but you might learn something. 
if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog, but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you could put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. Well, I ain't gonna lie, Terry, but I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy, bro. Might be an early night for me. Oh, you had a long day too, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm sleepy than a mug, bro. I'm sitting here thinking about, hey, I'm about to go to bed. About to pop me some popcorn and go to bed, bro. <laughs> oh, man. We had a long night last night, bro. I got up, man, and. I don't know, bro. I just been chilling today. Been chilling today. They say he got two missions, though. I don't see him. Oh, he got one with Franklin. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, definitely good night. Don't touch me. Oh, you don't have the call to tell me that. Not you. The Dieter Sachs store detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. I'll see what we helping with. I'm probably do this mission, man. Go to bed, man. Of course they're gone. Who are you talking to? Come on, I'll take you back to the house. 
Successful crook. You're a bit of a failure, but hey, kudos for trying. Not that successful if you're in witness protection. Well, I've got an idea. Why don't we see what Agent Dave and the FIB think of these lovers on the run? Turn that off! You are not a child! You know, I'm sort of thankful for this. Thankful? This is the worst day of my life. Ah, oh, come on, you're doing your part. Your spending habits have got us into a sticky financial situation, so you're cutting corners. Really? My spending habits? I've seen your day trader account. Oh, hey, that's private. Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and yeah, thank you. Oh, I gotta be Franklin. Alright. I think I'm gonna pause right here. To put us about at the hour mark. Oh man, my bad Terrence, bro. I'm just oh, I'm just tired tonight, bro. Mm. Cool. Mm -mm -mm. Boy, just tired. I know what I know what happened. But uh, yeah, bro, I will be live tomorrow. Uh, what are we gonna do tomorrow? I might just tap into some God of War tomorrow. I think I might do my ATS stream, do a load. I ain't that suck, bro. We ain't get that load done. I was so upset. I ain't gonna lie, I was so upset. Uh, yeah, so we might do a load tomorrow. Then hop on some God of War. That's what I'm thinking. Yep. But, uh, hey, man. Have a good night, bro. Appreciate you coming through, man. Kicking it with me for a second. And, uh, I'll see you tomorrow, bro. Get you some rest, man. I hope you have a great and blessed day tomorrow, bro. And, uh, I'll see you then, man. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate everybody. Love y'all, Beast Day Nation. We out of here.